Hi there, I'm Jay. I'm a helicopter pilot with STARS, Shock Trauma Air Rescue Service in Alberta. And what we do is we transport critically injured patients from the emergency scene right to the hospital. We always fly with two pilots up front, and we fly with a paramedic and a flight nurse, sometimes a doctor too. Hi. Hello. So it's a great job and an important service, and it saves lives. Helicopters are a marvel of modern engineering. These things are dripping in math and physics. So take a look at where all the main rotors come together, right here at the main swash plate assembly. It's incredible. This is what allows the helicopter to fly forwards, backwards, left and right. So the shape of the rotor blades are just like the wings on an airplane, and they provide lift when they're turning. So the rotor is curved on top and flat on the bottom. This forces air going over the top to move faster than the air on the bottom. This makes low pressure on top and provides lift. And when we create enough lift, we start to fly. Let me jump down and I'll show you how this works. Imagine my arms are the rotor blades. When they spin really fast, they become a disc, just like a dinner plate. <laughs> There's a smaller rotor at the back of the helicopter called the tail rotor. When the main rotor turns, the body of the helicopter wants to turn the opposite direction, and the tail rotor prevents it and keeps it straight. Flying a helicopter is a lot like juggling. I use my left hand, my right hand, and both my feet. My right hand moves the cyclic. When I push it forward, the helicopter goes forward. When I pull it back, the helicopter moves back. And I can move the helicopter left and right. My left hand controls the collective. When I pull up on it, the helicopter goes up in the sky. And when I push down on it, the helicopter goes down to the earth. To become a helicopter pilot, you must attend flight school and you have to know your math and physics. Why well, become a helicopter pilot? So you can fly helicopters. I never get stuck in traffic, and at the end of the shift, as an air ambulance pilot, I know that I've done something good and I've helped someone.